Welcome back to another episode of Moto GP Mac, and today we're going to talk about Franco Morbidelli's comments after the Italian Grand Prix in Mugello. Now, as we know, Franco Morbidelli finished a genuine 10th place ahead of Fabio Quadraro on Sunday's race. And, you know, he was fairly happy about how he performed. He said, you know, it was a decent weekend. We worked to the maximum. We made the right choices. We made the right modifications on the bike. The team worked very hard to maximize what we have. Finally, this top 10 came. We are not where we want to be for sure, but we needed to bring the bike home and we got a top 10. We know our position is not good and we are doing our maximum. We are expressing very good work at the races, but we need to keep going as we know it's not enough. He said towards the end of the race, I passed Bastanini, but I caught up with Marco, Aleish and Miller. I was behind them, but my front tire pressure then went up. I couldn't brake as I wanted to, so I just needed to bring the bike home in one piece. Then the reporter asked him if he thought that this top 10 finish could help him earn his new contract. And he said, I don't care. I don't care. I just need to be focused on being the best professional I can be, the best rider I can be. I don't race according to my future or according to my contract. I race according to my passion. He was then asked ab again about his future and he said, do I want to secure another year with Yamaha? And the reporter asked him, well, do you? And he said, talk with Lynn. So I think it's kind of very funny that he is saying, go talk to Lynn. Has the internal decision been made? Has Franco already told Yamaha that he is not going to be riding with them next year? This does open the question to where is Franco going to go for the 2024 season? It was rumored that he was going to go to Yamaha World Superbikes. But Franco came out last week and said you know, that he does believe that he will be on the grid in 20. 24 for moto gp now the only other logical place for me because when you look at franco's reputation right now it has been severely damaged by what's happened in yamaha the only place that i would think would accept him with open arms is vr46 now they do have basecki and marini and you know i will find it interesting whether to keep Franco Morbidelli in MotoGP, will they allow Basecki go to Pramac? I know Uzio said no, but you know, if Franco is without a ride next year, are they going to leave him um fall out of Moto the MotoGP paddock? Which I don't think they will. So I think there is going to be something happen in the merry go round in the VR forty six team. But I would definitely love to know your thoughts. What do you think of Franco's comments? And where do you think Franco will be next season? Definitely leave your thoughts in the comments below. And I'll be back again tomorrow with another video.